welcome back to another episode of Fish Central. Today I'm going to be doing um, my top fall baits to use, like late fall. So um, I'll go first to last. So my favorite bait to use to throw is a deep diving crankbait. So this right here is a rap shad. Dives like 14 feet. And this right here is a Matsuo swagger shad in gold minnow. So depending on what you have in your lake, if you have shad, this one's going to work in your lake. If you don't, you're going to be going after the smaller minnows, and I do not have shad in my local lake, so this one I'll be using. But this will do pretty well, too. So I'll probably throw both of them. Uh, my second favorite is a square bill. So this is just a pumpkin seed pattern square bill. It works very well all time of the year for me. And when the water is a little murky... I'll throw the KVD 1.5 in a chartreuse pattern. Alright, next bait would be a lipless crankbait or a rattle trap, whatever you want to call it. So this one is a red eye chad. I don't have shad, like I said, in my lake, but it still works. They're not paying too much attention to the detail on it. Um, yeah, this works pretty well. Um, this is a cotton cordell super spot rattle trap. It's in a crayfish color. And I have a lot of crayfish in my lake, so figured this would work out pretty well. So, next would be my jigs. So these are in two colors. This one is in bloom black, and this one is in desert. Uh, both half ounce. Very sturdy weed guard on this. I forget what brand it is. Uh, uh... Terminator? No. This is a an Eagle Claw one. Um, I just buy these ones. They're a little cheaper too. And the hooks are a lot better than the ones you get like this. The Wii Guard. Because Eagle Claw manufactures those items. So I like to throw the jigs um, <clears throat> when they haven't quite yet moved to deeper water. Like up on the banks and stuff. When like the soft plastics, wacky rig, Texas rig, when those aren't working. So to use like kind of on the banks. Um, Alright. Fourth. No, th fifth bait I like to throw is a jerk bait. Basically, they're just like suspending baits. Give it twitch, twitch, pause, twitch, pause, twitch, twitch, pause, twitch, pause. And, um,. This is just in clear minnow. It's a usury. I've had it for a couple years. Caught me a lot of fish in the fall. Um, and this one, still in the package, is a Storm Twitch Stick. Now, I've heard really good things, read things about this. So I'm really excited to try this. I'm gonna pick. definitely going to pick up more of these. Just in different colors. This is obviously in the se Sexy Shad. So, I mean, I'm really excited about this one. Uh, I might actually throw these also in uh, pre spawn. Works well. Suspending minnows. So, my last favorite bait is if I had to choose, it would just be a drop shot. Now, these are drop shot worms. Uh, they're ribbon tail. And they're very cheap. I don't know. I've never used this brand. I just needed some drop shot worms, so I went to Walmart and picked these up. They were like 99 cents. So this is black and blue, or purple and blue. And they're like 3 inches. Probably in total 3 inches. And I have like a, a watermelon or red pumpkin or something like that. And like four inch version, so I mean drop shots, but I would not really go for a drop shot in late fall. It's not really my like go to bait. I would definitely go with like a hard bait, something that you can really get down there. So, um, those are all the baits. If I had to pick the colors and order them, 